Hi, I'm here today with Rico Theta to teach you guys how to take a picture with this, upload it to Google Photos, and then view those 360 degree photos with Google Daydream using the Google VR. All right, you can see that this Wi-Fi signal is on fully, meaning that I've connected to it with my phone over Wi-Fi. In the Rico Theta app, which I'll link in the description, um, once you're connected to it, it should show you a preview of what your camera sees. Using the app, I will now take a picture. In the app, you should get a preview of what the image will look like. You can see now that the image that we took with the Rico Theta was automatically uploaded to Google Photos. This can be accomplished by going into your Google Photos settings and simply setting up an automatic update uh, with the folder that all Rico Theta photos are stored in. This way there's no cables, no API, it's just you take the picture with the application, automatically is viewable in Google Photos. All right, now that we have our photos uh, stored within Google Photos, we're gonna use our Daydream compatible phone to go into the application and view our photos in 360 with the Google VR. Go. You're gonna pair the remote, Daydream remote, with your phone via Bluetooth. So now, uh, in the Google Daydream settings, we're gonna go look at our photos that we just uploaded via, from the Rico Theater. So I'm gonna hit the library, and you should see a list of applications. Now, if you have a Daydream ready phone, Google Photos should be already installed. Let's go to Google Photos. Wait for the application to load. All right, and you can see uh, an album of VR-ready photos, and this is the one that we actually just took. Uh, and it's taking this from our Google Photos library. Everything's set up. So let's take a look at this. Give it a second to load. All right. And you can see that we can now view our photo in complete 360 degrees. Super clear. Daydream looks awesome, as to be expected. You can also see your remote within the headset. And this remote is actually this real position, so if I was to you know, drop the remote, I was like, and I don't know where it is, I can simply look for it on my screen and actually know where to pick it up. There's its own set of settings um, within the remote, and so if I click that, I can navigate some other pictures that I've taken earlier today. Now obviously this effect lo looks best with VR photos, but you can actually view normal photos and panoramas with the Google VR, which is very cool. All right, that's it for viewing photos in Google Daydream. Um, I hope that this video has helped you understand how you can get photos from your Rico data, automatically send them to upload to Google Photos, and then view that photo with Google Daydream. It's all assisted by uh, the interactivity of Google's applications. It makes it super easy and super fast to view your photos.